Hello, welcome to the Java tutorial. Uh, in the first tutorial, I will show you how to run the first simple Java program with the command prompt. Okay, uh, let us get started. Uh, Java, uh, everything in Java, everything is declared in class since it is object oriented programming language. So first we call the class and the name name of the class we will declare it say hello okay and under this class we will write our code so first we will call the our main function main this is our main function where we will put the code and uh, now it's called system dot out dot print ln okay and inside this mm, we will call hello world okay and put this the semicolon after this and now, now uh, this is the class under where we have declared our main function and, and inside the main function we will we are displaying simply hello world so first save it uh, I am saving this in Java on my desktop uh, the name must matches the class name hello dot Java okay now go to the comp compiler a uh, command prompt and the my file is where I have stored my file is Java and desktop you should give the path or simply go to that and type Java C the compiler and the name of the search is hello dot Java and the class file has uh, the com compiler Java compiler has compiled the hello dot Java file and created a class which I will show you uh, this is the file hello and our uh, this is the hello our file java file and this is the class file the java file created the class file and we have that after creating the class file we only going to get the output uh, so let's get the output type java and simply type hello must see see this hello here uh, okay simple this is quite simple let's change something here and copy this and and paste it say hello hello two times hello okay now recompile it by calling simply and now sim simply call hello and see just now I will tell you what this mean this class is what we declare everything is in Java is class so we call the class name as hello and where we have declaring our main function we which is public which is public means it's it can be accessed anywhere and it must be and this this is a static uh, you can read about more in the future tutorial and void return type which you if you have gone through the C you know about that and these are the argument 